So uh, the first column in the template is sequence. Second column is whether it's value added, non-value added. And you basically handle that the same way. You go to the elements tab. And of course, everything from the Excel template is passed down here. So it's already here. But let's just say you wanted to, uh, for instance, uh, change this walk to storage from required non-value added to non-value added. So what you would do is you would tap your stylus <coughs> right on that particular item. And you can see it's telling us it's currently required. We can make it non-value added and it will change it out of there. So it just changes it for you here directly on here. So again, just tap on the item you want to change. If you make it value added, it'll just take it out. Uh, value added is either blank or you can put a V in, but nobody puts a V in, right? So that'll take it out. So if you put it back to the required non-value added, just click on it and it'll put it right there. So again, the value added, non-value added classifications are extremely easy in Timer Pro.